Hi, welcome to your GPS moment. What's the point of going to church? I hear that question often. Social media is a buzz with people that call themselves X. Uh, don't go to church anymore. It's too much drama, too many hypocrites. Uh, people don't live out their beliefs. What's the point? I can watch a better sermon in my house without all the drama. I just want to talk to you for a moment. First of all, I want to address something that is real. There is church hurt in a lot of people from this generation. People that grew up in houses where religion was shoved down their throat. That could be you. And I just want to say personally, I'm sorry, I apologize. But those people are not God. See, being a disciple of Jesus is much more than attending church, but it's never less than attending church. We see in scripture, for example, the story of Lydia. Lydia was worshiping underneath a tree, right? They were gathered for worship. So the church is not the building. The church is the people. So they gather for worship. And the Bible says that God opened her heart and she received them that day and was baptized. I'm wondering how many blessings just because you follow what other people say and just because you're discouraged uh, because of what has happened in your life. What blessings are you not getting? What moments is God able to open your heart but he can't because you've neglected a significant aspect of your spiritual walk. So I just want to encourage you. I want you to understand that being religious is different from being a Christian. Being religious is somebody that does religious rites, but being a Christian is being a follower of Jesus. And it's much more than just going to church, but it's never less than. So I'm inviting you just to give church another try. Maybe the, the one that you went to, maybe there's another option, but there are healthy, life-giving churches that can breathe life into you as you volunteer, worship together, connect with other like-minded believers. May God bless you in that journey.